Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, I figured I would share with y'all part of my quest to find a pin case that I like. Now this pin case I found on Amazon, it's a Keiko, K-A-C-O, 20 slot fountain pin case. And it ran about 20 bucks. And I am hoping, yeah there's all the info in the back. It's a Keiko pin case. Now what I'm hoping is I'm hoping this will be a good size for multi pins in addition to because I have way more multi pins than I have fountain pins and I've been looking for a good pin case to you know put my favorite multi pins in and also just kind of a general use pin case to carry the pins and so let me toss that all right so here's the pin case and it doesn't look too bad and on the surface. Let's unzip this thing. The zipper feels pretty solid. Oops. Bang the camera. All right. So what you have is you have the 10 slots and then you have like a folding protector thing cover and then you have the other 10 slots. That's not too bad. So let's try them out. So I grabbed a fountain pen. This is a Twisby Eco. And it's a pretty snug fit in there. Like that's a that's a tight fit. I don't know how good it's going to do if you have any like of the larger fountain pens. Now for my purposes, I wanted to try some other ones. So I'm going to try a Bic multi pen. Again, oh there's it's like the the these are tight. Like this right here is very tight. I don't really. Eh. All right. The problem is, this is this is a tight squeeze for this fountain pen, and this is a small fountain pen. If you want to try, I think this one is a little thicker. Might be a teeny bit thicker right around here. So like, if you insert this one, that one goes in pretty good. One thing that I do like is they're distinctly separated. Like there's a there's a divide in here. The problem is though, you're not going to get any uh, like this is the this is the biggest fountain pen I think is going to fit. Now, if you have some normal pens, like I grabbed a handful of pens. So like this one fits fine. And this is a Pentel Energel. And this one fits okay, no problem. Uh, a Sharpie, just for size comparison. Again, it's kind of a little snug fit, but not too bad. Uh, here's a Pentel Ink Joy. This one is, ooh, it was a pretty snug fit, and then it kind of slid in there. And kind of the Sharpie. And then one of the Pilot multi pens. All right, so, hmm, uh, let me finish this out. I'll put another pin. All right, so what I think is I'm thinking this is probably a decent pin case, but maybe not a very good fountain pen. Like, it, 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 it works for these size fountain pens, but if you have any of the larger, fancier fountain pens, like one of the, you know, with the larger barrel, uh, I, um, larger circumference barrels they're not going to fit I mean like these are these are all all these are snug fits this being probably the least snug fit so hmm I feel like this is not this this would be pretty close to exactly what I want for multi pens but maybe not for fountain pens or maybe kind of a general use pen case because you got enough for 20 pens and the quality looks not spectacular, but it looks like okay quality. I mean, I'm sure it's made in China, so that's to be expected. But the thing is, the zipper feels pretty solid. It doesn't feel like it's going to immediately fall apart on you. These are very snug, and they're pretty well stitched in there. At least it seems like it. So, this might not be a bad pin case. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try this with my multi-pins and see how I like it. Because that's kind of what I was after. 
and or maybe either multi pins or a general use pin case. That's a tough question. I'm not really sure which I'm going to do yet, but I think I'm going to probably put this one to use. So I guess it looks like if you're looking for a pin case and you're not expecting like spectacular but functional would work. The only thing is you can't you can't have pins much wider than this one, like much bigger in circumference or they're not going to fit. Because these, this elastic is super snug right now for these. Hmm. Anyway, let me know what you think. And if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope you all have an excellent day.